Hey again, it's Joel here from Joel and Becky's Cards and Toys, and um, well, had a little bit more time before it was time to go to work today, so we grabbed another envelope for uh, Saturday afternoon arrivals since we had time. I honestly can't wait to see what's in all of them, but we had time to do like one more today. This one's from Omni Comics and Cards, and there's the address if you want to check them out. They are pretty cool. I honestly, like I said, I don't know. It's been in the bag for quite a while. So, without further ado, we're going to get a little bonus afternoon arrival, Saturday afternoon arrivals today. We're going to open this up and see what's in what's in here. Then, we got to go to work. It is a 1978 Jack Morris rookie card and it's in pretty good shape so <laughs> randomly today turned out to be a 1978 day that's pretty cool there's the back we'll take it out here to check out the condition a little bit this is definitely an iconic card one that I didn't have and I would see cheap but it would usually be in really really bad shape these these ones are really hard to find it's a little off-center uh, just a little bit and definitely minor soft corners but for for someone who just wants to have the card because he grew up loving this card I loved this this set when I was younger um, it was hard to get your hands on it it was kind of expensive back in the day too but uh definitely a nice pickup little soft corners there too Definitely one of the better ones that I've seen though. It's usually really off center or the corners are usually really beat up. Uh, I've noticed a lot have printing marks, which actually the color and the printing on this one's like really good. So yeah, today turned out to be a, a 1978 day because we got the Nolan Ryan earlier. Um, definitely cool. Well, it's just about time to get ready for work. We thought we'd sneak that one in there. I can't wait to put that one in the collection. Definitely can knock that one off the list now. I love collecting the older rookie cards and just really nice vintage stuff. You know, you grew up looking at at card shows and couldn't really afford with lawn mowing money, which was how I got my cards back then. Used to mow lawns, do chores for people in the neighborhood. I uh, used to deliver newspapers. It was never more than maybe ten or fifteen dollars at the most I would I would have, and I remember this card was going for that much all the time. Found this one for like two bucks I think I'm trying to remember I believe yeah it was about two bucks from uh, Omni Comics and Cards so if you get a chance check them out I'm pretty sure they have an eBay store and they have really good prices on especially like older stuff like this and definitely priced according to condition which I don't mind I'm not in it for the money uh, the money actually holds me back from getting a lot of cool cards that I just like them because they're cool and good way to pass time in between, you know, having to go to work. So uh, with that being said, again, hope everybody's having a great weekend. And that's our second afternoon arrival for the day, 1978. Earlier was the Nolan Ryan. Today is Jack Morris rookie. So definitely a good day today. We'll be in a good mood at work about that. And I uh, hope everybody else is having a good weekend. And we'll be back tomorrow with something else. I think we're going to do a Sunday set look through tomorrow where we pick a random set and just kind of take a look at some of the highlights and talk about that for a minute or two. So be on the lookout for that series to be starting tomorrow. Some of the complete sets, kind of like we took a look at the pro debut set earlier. Um, yep, till next time, everybody have a great day.